A community staple in Milford has announced it is in danger of closing due to financial struggles. The Milford Independent Cinema is one of the few remaining small independent theaters left in the state of Michigan. Just this past month, the Maple Theater in Bloomfield Township had to close its doors. And before that, the main art theater in Royal Oak was forced to shut down as well. But Milford is not giving up without a fight. Tonight's 7 Action News reporter Sarah Michaels takes us to the cinema to learn how they are working to stay open and how you can help. The Milford Independent Cinema has been in this building for over 50 years, but will they be able to stay here in the future? It looks like that decision is now up to the community. If the doors happen to close one day, I think they would really miss that sense of community and how this this theater brings people together. And that's what Julia Hill Lynn is fighting to save. Friday, she and other members of the Huron Valley Film Organization launched a 10K in 10 days fundraiser to save the Milford Independent Cinema, a place that's much more than just a small local movie theater to a small southeast Michigan town. I remember seeing Titanic in, in that theater when I was a young kid. And it's usually the parents that come in and they're like, oh, I came here for my first movie back when I was four. I came here, you know, so we hear that over and over again. They're a piece of the community. And they've been that for decades. The board has been hosting elementary school field trips, local birthday parties, and charity events. But it comes at a cost. The cinema says the 10K in 10 days fundraiser is a response to financial hardships that have put them in danger of closing. Maybe they can't compete with Imagine or these bigger theaters, but... It's got a unique feel to it, and it's a part of my childhood, and it's really a part of everyone's childhood that's lived here long enough. The monetary struggle comes as this cinema is one of the few remaining small independent theaters left in the state. Just recently, the Maple Theater in Bloomfield Township had to close their doors, and before that, the main art theater in Royal Oak was forced to close as well. Why is it so imperative that we make sure we still have smaller cinemas like this? Bringing in these um, dance schools, bringing in singers for Valentine's Day. Um, those are the types of things that these smaller cinemas can offer the community that you're just not going to find at these larger cinemas. Cinema staff tells me that all funds from the 10K in 10 days donations will go to operational costs at the theater. If it's any inclination of how beloved this small theater is, Friday afternoon, during their first few hours of fundraising, they were already at $3,500. I just think there's nothing like seeing the movie on the big screen versus the little screen. It's just a totally different experience. In Milford, Sarah Michaels, 7 Action News. Aw, thank you so much, Sarah.